Wall number three! Hey guys, welcome back to the Ball Shredder channel, and yes, it is time to do Timu Hall number three. And as you saw, yeah, I got that purple strat and I got that white guitar body. I'll be showing those and talking about those in a minute, but first, we're gonna see what's in the bag. So this time, my only non-guitar related item would be this right here. And these look pretty cool. And these are basically kitchen rags, kitchen towels to, you know, like wipe up water and stuff. And I grabbed these because I really need them. You know, when I'm doing stuff in the kitchen and the sink, water's always splashing all over the place. My kids are always splashing water all over the sink and it just kind of sits there and you don't want that. And I'm always trying to wipe it up with, with other stuff. And these look like they're gonna be really absorbent and they're supposed to be like reusable. You know, you can wash them and use them again and again and again, which is what I wanted. And yeah, I mean, I think these are gonna work really well. Now, before I get to everything else, guys, I need to tell you that there is a 50% off discount code right now for new users. Here's the code. I'm also gonna have the code and the link that will take you to the website or the app where you can download the app and get that 50% off on your order if you are a new user. All right, let's see what kind of guitar goodies I got this time. So in here we've got, oh, I know what this is. This is a guitar hanger. You see all my guitars hanging on the wall back there? I've got them over here, I've got them over there, I've got a whole bunch of them. This is ex the exact same one as those. So I think, did I get one or two of these? I don't know. So I'll be hanging up another guitar soon. A set of black tuners for one of my many millions of guitar projects that are coming up. A set of chrome tuners for one of my millions of guitar projects coming up. Another set of black tuners. Okay, yeah, I ordered one set for a regular headstock and then the other one is for a reversed headstock because I've got some of that stuff coming up. And last but not least, out of the bag anyway, is I've got these uh, two switches here, the blade switches for, you know, switching between the pickups. And again, I'm gonna need those for all my guitar projects. In addition to the goodies in the bag, I also got this white Strat guitar body. It is completely finished, painted, got the high gloss on it and everything. All you need to do is like, you know, install all the hardware, put a neck on it and finish it. And this sells for like, $51 on Timu. I don't know of another website where you can get completely finished and painted, talking about painted, finished, guitar bodies at that price. Everywhere else where I've seen painted guitar bodies, they've always been more money than that. So guys, I haven't decided exactly what I'm gonna do with this guitar body, but I'm thinking that I'll use one of the two pit guards that I got back in my Timu haul number two. Remember those two pit guards? So one of them will fit right on here. And then I'll add everything else and eventually I'm gonna have my Timu caster. But regarding the body guys, I mean it's, the, the finish is perfect. There are no mess ups in the finish anywhere. Really nice. It's got this blue X on the back. I don't know why that's there, but you could very easily cover that up with something. So yeah, totally impressed by this, especially at that price. But now it's time for the big guns. This is what we've been waiting to see, and man, I need to tell you guys about this guitar. Now, if you remember back in my video for my Timu Hall number one, I also got another Strat-style electric guitar. And it was okay, and I mentioned that it was, you know, really good for, like, modding and upgrading and changing things, and you'd need to do some setup and various things like that. Well, let me just tell you guys that this guitar is way better than that one. And this is selling for like $116 on Timu right now. First of all, I gotta talk about the finish. Look at this, purple sparkle. It's amazing. How many of these inexpensive, budget priced, like, you know, cheaper Strat style guitars that you can get on eBay, wherever, they're never in the nice sparkly colors like this. I've never seen the purple sparkle color for something that's just barely over a hundred bucks. It's always just those, you know, plain black, white, yellow, red, blue, whatever, but nothing like this. And not only is it purple sparkle, but it's a great purple sparkle and they did a fantastic job on it. There's no mess ups on the finish anywhere. Okay, but that's not enough to get me super excited about this guitar. It's the neck and the setup and the fretwork yeah, I didn't do anything to this guitar except tune it, literally, seriously. No adjustments on the bridge, I didn't turn the truss, truss rod, nothing. I didn't do anything to the frets, 
and this thing came with really low action. Now you would think that on an inexpensive guitar, barely over a hundred bucks, that the fretwork is gonna be like atrocious, right? And you're gonna have all these buzzing notes all over the neck, especially with low action like this one. But no, not in the case of this guitar. It's got low action and I'm not getting any buzzing frets. And I like this one because it's got the maple neck and the maple fretboard. And it's not a high gloss finish. It's either got no finish or like a very light satin finish. And I'm happy to say that the frets are not teeny tiny, which drives me crazy. These are not. Now the neck profile, it is not super thin because you know, this is more like a uh, fender neck, I guess you could say. So not thin at all. But for me, you know, I like those thin Charvel necks, but since this is, uh, doesn't have the high gloss and it's barely got like a satin finish, it'll be super easy for me to take some sandpaper and make it thinner. All right guys, I want you to hear me play it a little bit and then I'm gonna talk more about the pickups and stuff. All right, check it out. Like I said, low action and enjoyable to play. The only downside, guys, and I don't know if this is really a downside, but it's pretty much what you would expect for a guitar that costs $116, is that the pickups are really super weak. But you would expect that, right? You're not gonna have great sounding, expensive, single coil pickups in a Strat copy style guitar that costs 116 bucks. And if you're expecting that at that price, then your expectations are way out of whack. So this guitar is totally worth buying because of the paint, the beautiful purple sparkle, because the neck, the neck is completely usable. You do not need to like swap the neck out. The only thing that I would recommend and that, that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change the pit guard and I'm gonna put better pickups in there. I'm thinking like a black pearl pit guard with two humbuckers, that would be sweet. I don't feel any need to change the bridge. I don't feel any need to change the tuners, guys. If you remember back from my first Timu video, the Strat copy again that I already talked about, those tuners were horrible. They would stick and you couldn't turn them and they were, they were junk. These don't have that problem at all. They're smooth, they, they turn. So other than changing the pick guard and the pickups, um, the one thing that I would probably do and I would recommend for everybody is to change the nut. You can get a Tusk XL nut on eBay for like $10 or less and it's really easy to swap it out. Now as far as the brand name guys, it's like D Lasso or De Lasso. I'm not even sure how you would say that. So I just wanna remind you guys that this stuff is not made by Timu, right? Timu is like Amazon. They're selling stuff from a bunch of different manufacturers. So the other Strat guitar that I got, it was made by somebody else. And then this one is made by another company. So that's why there's like a discrepancy in the quality and the setup and stuff. And apparently this one's much better. So yeah, I totally recommend this to you guys. If it's like you like the colors and they do have different colors guys and um, their stuff sells out all the time. Like it sells out and then it's back in stock. 
and then one week it'll be sold out and then two weeks later something will be back in stock. So if you're looking at the link for this guitar and you don't see the purple sparkle one, they do have other colors, but it might be back in stock later. And just to drive my point home, guys, about stuff being in stock and then new stuff, there's constantly new stuff. I just looked at Timu on my computer right before I started recording this video, just to check the price again, right? And guess what I saw on there that I didn't see on there yesterday? They're now selling a body, this exact body, just the body, like the white body that I had, but it's purple sparkle, strap body, and it's selling on Timu for $47. And that is a killer deal. So yeah, back to this guitar, guys. I never thought I would be this impressed with getting a guitar on Timu, but man, I am. And um, you know what? I, I can't believe I'm doing this, but um, yeah, this guitar is getting the bald shredder stamp of approval. All right, guys, so remember, there is that 50% off discount code for new users. The link is in the description. Check it out. Go there, download the app, and start your shopping on Timu. As usual, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.